Hey, what's up, YouTube? Surreal Canine here. Welcome back to more Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. A promise revisited. <laughs> no, this is Explorers of Sky, and we are playing Beedoof's Wish, starring Buck the Beedoof. In the last episode, uh, we got a map in a happenstance encounter with a snowbird named Chili. It's being a uh, chased by a pair of, uh, probably a pair of thieves, uh, who we have named Itchy and Scratchy. And, uh, Chili was holding a map to a place called Star Cave, and according to, uh, Guild Deputy Paul, he is, er, Star Cave is the hiding place of the legendary Pokemon Jirachi, who has the power to grant wishes. So, this is pretty exciting stuff, uh, so we decided to go on a mission together with Chili and, uh, have our wish granted. Let's go! Star Cave. It's over there. Fuck! Looks like we're ready. Alright, let's go explore Star Cave. I'm a bit nervous. It's alright, yo, yo. We don't have anything to worry about when we're together. Yeah. Let's do our best, yo, yo. I should have gotten some more to drink. <laughs> so, yeah. The thing about Chili is, uh, he is kind of a detriment to your well-being. No statuses, but, uh, yeah. You know the hail? That is caused by Chili's ability. It'll start healing on every floor, and every couple of turns, since Buck is not Ice-type, he will be taking a little bit of damage. Oh yeah, I guess I should talk a bit about Buff's, uh, Buck's stats here. <coughs> Buck is a Bidoof. No surprise there. He has Simple, which, uh, doubles the effect of, uh, stat buffs and debuffs, and Unaware, which allow you to ignore a fo an enemy's stat buffs and debuffs. An interesting combination, and if he was also moody, uh, things would be especially hectic, but we don't have that. This is not Gen 5. It's got a 17 in every stat, which is pretty decent. It's uh, certainly more than Daniel started with. In any case... We're going to set Tackle to be our uh, main attack, because it is our only attack. Cricket top here. Oh no! When we are wrapped, we can't do a thing. It's kind of the worst thing. Uh, yeah. Deal with the uh, chingling as you are able. Snover ha thankfully has a couple of uh, moves here. That'll help us. Uh, one of them you saw was Ice Blast, which appears to be a, uh, a ranged attack. The other, Powder Snow, hits an entire room. So, uh, he's pretty powerful, and as you can see, he's stronger than we are. So, who knows why he is so timid and all, and why he came to us for help. <coughs> now, you want to be careful in this dungeon, because, uh... I believe this is the first instance of uh, being able to find a monster house. A monster house is a room filled with items and enemy Pokemon. They all spawn in at once and just swarm you. It is the worst thing. <laughs> Especially if you uh, appear in one as your first uh, as your first room, or even your first room in the entire dungeon. So 
So yeah, uh, orange berries. You will be glad you have them. Another thing uh, you can probably do to help yourself out a bit is to use Defense Curl. Thanks to Buck's simple ability, it has double effect, so we have just doubled our defense. I guess it doesn't show on our stat screen, but yeah. Welcome! Make sure you pick up a couple of rainy and sunny orbs here in the shops. This is also our uh, first example of seeing a shop in the dungeon. You are technically able to steal from a shop, but the Kecleons guarding the shop are level 90 plus and uh, very dangerous. In addition to just being level 90 plus. We are not going to want to make them angry. Now, let's just uh, buy an orb. We are only able to buy one, but <coughs> that is fine. It's time for us to continue. It's time for the world to continue. It's time for the bad weather to continue or something. Escape orb! You are going to want to have one of those at all times. I uh, kind of forgot to pick one up out of storage. Assuming we even had one to begin with, I don't remember. But yeah, if you can rush to the stairs in this dungeon, do so. And if you can't, use a rainy or sunny orb to change the weather. This will power up water type moves, but uh, it is perhaps a fair trade if you. Uh, Compare that against the uh, taking damage every couple of turns. A scanner orb, uh, well, it looks like there's a shop in the room above us. We kind of do not have very much money, though. And we do not really have anything worth selling, either. Oh, well. Aneroth, again, rock and bug type. Kind of a, uh, thing, but Buck's tackle is more than powerful enough to take it out in one hit. There we go! A totter seed. That is very good for our health. At least when it comes time to fight a boss. I just hope we can find one more by the end of the dungeon. Doesn't look like there are any other rooms in this uh, area. Ooh, oh, very, very nice. Alright. I think this part of the dungeon is seven floors long. I I don't entirely remember. To tell you the truth. Bonsly, is, uh, contrary to its appearance, is a rock-type Pokémon. Not rock and grass, just pure rock. I might even say, it's hard rock. Let's see... What should I sell? I don't really feel like selling anything, honestly. Lotad you want to watch out for, because uh, if it's raining and they decide to use Water Gun, you are in for a world of hurt. That is one reason I recommend uh, grabbing a Zinc Fan and holding on to it. You can find them in this dungeon. I got lucky on my first run. All Hit or boosts critical hit ratios. That could come in handy. Unfortunately, it will not work against the boss, so uh, save it for a monster house, I guess is what I'm saying. Here we have an apple. It's uh, always good to have at least one of those. I kind of forgot. Story of my story, I guess. I don't know. <coughs> Ooh, that's a good amount of money.
The good thing about Tackle is it has 30 PP, so you can just use it as much as you dang well please and uh, get topped right off by a Max Elixir. So it's not the case for many more powerful moves, but uh, this is Special Episode 1. We'll, we'll be fine as long as we keep our wits about us. A Graveler Rock will come in very handy against at least one of the bosses. You're going to want to stockpile those, too. Ouch. Um, I forgot that Bonsai learned to low kick. That being a fighting type move, uh, it is a problem for us. I believe low kick uh, uses the target's weight as a factor in its damage formula. So fortunately it didn't do very much. Ooh, yeah, swagger. That could be dangerous. For us, I mean. <laughs> Confusing an enemy Pokemon is all well and good, but if one of the but if they like to use physical attacks and they hit us with something while they're all buffed like that, that we are going to be in a world of hurt. Alright, here we are on the seventh floor. Let's hope we find another Totter Seed. If not, uh, we are going to be in trouble. As you can see, Buff's special defense is, uh... What the heck? Why do you know Ice Beam? Yeah. We are able to buff his physical defense, his special defense not so much, which is why I wanted to hold on to a zinc band. But, uh... This is a little dangerous of a uh, situation that we are in. Is this a tot- Yes! Another totter seed! Okay. We're good to go. All we really need is two. If you have three, you are golden. Oh yeah, there's a checkpoint here. Checkpoints uh, show up in certain plot-related dungeons. It's a place where you can uh, save the game and access your storage. Or in this case, just save your game. We are not going to do that. Actually, let's see what Chili has to say before we move on. Okay, cool. Even more hail. Our, uh, our belly kind of refill itself, but that's fine. Belly increased. Hmm. Oh, I might as well use this. The weather didn't change. Did I miss something? Gulpin uh, has kind of high HP. Again, don't be afraid to, uh, ooh, Cherry Berry. But I can't think of any Pokemon here that would paralyze us, so let's just pass by it. Always nice to keep your belly topped off. Never know when you might run into a long drought of uh, not having food. Water Spore is a room area of effect attack that reduces the power of fire moves. So, slightly less useless than Mud Spore, is what we were saying. Psyducks are not really a big deal, unless they hit you, unless it's raining, of course.
Again, you always want to surround the enemy Pokemon whenever you can. Might as well, right? Bronzong is a psychic steel type that also resists fire and I think ice. I know it resists fire. Which is a pain. Uh because ordinarily steel type Pokemon are weak to fire. You're probably better off using a dark type move or like a ground type or something. I don't know. We don't have any of those though. All we have is our normal type tackle. And whatever the heck Chili decides to do. Oh, huh? this? This looks like a dead end. This looks like the deepest part. The depths of Star Cave. Where's Jirachi? <laughs> Who's there? <laughs> who, who is that? <laughs> you really are so cool. You come trustingly all the way here. <laughs> who are you? <laughs> Long time no see. I've seen you since we met at Treasure Town. <laughs> What are you doing here? Jirachi's place in Star Cave is... I thought me and Chili were the only ones who had the map and knew how to get here. Why are you... Why are you here? <laughs> Jirachi was never here. What? Star Cave, Jirachi, they were all made up. And they never were here from the start. That's what I'm saying. You were tricked into coming here. By us. See. What? Us? What do you mean, us? We're the band of thieves, Team Rogue. We trick our marks and take what we want. We're thieves, we're rogues. You get it yet? We're the bad guys. <laughs> At least he's enjoying it. I am their leader, the Great Chili. <laughs> At least he's not Poochie. <laughs> that time? When you were standing in front of the Kecleon shop stewing? <coughs> what should I do? Should I buy it? Shouldn't I? I don't know. To tell you the truth, I got the money for it, but... I got my own money. I always carry it with me. 7,000. Right then, we were watching you. When you pulled out that big wad of money, what a mark. I suddenly had an idea. I thought that money was ours to take, but if we mugged you right then and there, there would have been an uproar. That's why we put on this little show, to lure you out here. Then, the story about Star Cave and Jirachi is a complete fabrication. You see, we were pretty excited when we laid our hands on an ancient map. Wishes come true here, so we heard. We could get rich. So, we came here to find out. But there's nothing here. It's just the dead end. We are so disappointed. It's just a fake. The map, that is. Still angry, we came to Treasure Town, and there you were. Too bad. Your money. We're taking it. Prepare yourself. Eek! Step one, confuse chili. This is why we want totter seeds. Curses. Now, buff your defense. One or two times should be enough. Now, fire away! Snow protected itself with mist. I forget what mist does. Uh-oh! 
could uh, be trouble. I should probably eat a Chesto Berry just so, uh, just so Chili doesn't put me to sleep. Alright, Itchy goes down, and now we just have Chili to take care of. As you can see, uh, Chili's got some pretty high attack power. Gonna wanna keep ourselves topped off on HP, because if he decides to use Powder Snow, we are just screwed halfway to Wednesday. Uh, that sand attack sure did a number of damage. Oh dear. This is bad. Let's see, I'm probably gonna want to heal myself again. Not waste PP, and just wait for our confusion to wear off. Ooh! Icy Wind. It is a good thing we have Reviver Seeds. But, now we can light a Smackdown on it. Maybe. Got him! Unfortunately, we can't pick up the totter seed that he picked up. It's too tough. Of course, we lose anyway. <laughs> you are allowed to lose this battle. It's fine. <clears throat> you know you're weak. You're gonna resist and make us ask. Hurry, give us your money. No. That money is very important to me. Who do you think you are? Ugh, this one's really stubborn. Hey, you. We'll take it by force if we have to. Yeah! Wait! Huh? What? One. Don't shirk work. Two. Run away and pay. Three. Smiles go for miles. The Wigglytuff Guild is here! Uh-oh. Everyone. You, don't you dare pick on our apprentice. You better be ready! Uh, what, what, what do we do? Going up against the famous Wigglytuff guild? Uh, wait, don't run away. Don't believe the worldwide reputation and rumors. Jirachi's not in this cave, never has been. You're just scared of Wigglytuff's reputation of being really strong. Let's go, you guys. We'll take them on, too. Yeah! Let's go, everyone! Utah! Attack! Yeah! <laughs> Chili got hit with Disable. That's great. <laughs> Strong. <laughs> Maybe you should stop your wrongdoing. Hey, hey. Are you alright, Buck? Thanks, everyone. It's because you all came to help, then I'm alright. But, what are you all doing here? Mr. Paul told us about you acting strangely. Mr. Paul did? You were acting really strange. Daydreaming, and then suddenly you wanted to take the day off. So I talked to the Guildmaster, and secretly followed you to see what you were up to. Is that so? I... I will say this one thing. It wasn't because I was worried about you. Uh, no, I didn't think I'd tag along because I was worried at all. You were acting really strange. I thought maybe you were deserting the guild. So I had to see for myself. That's it. 
Don't misunderstand. <laughs> well put. Well said, truly! Mr. Paul, when you told everyone about Buck, you really were worried about him. Hey, hey! Be quiet! As for everyone coming along, at first it was going to be myself and the Guildmaster coming to rescue Buck, but in the end, everyone wanted to come along. <sighs> because... Once we heard that you were acting strange, Buck, we couldn't ignore it. <clears throat> We've always been strict teachers in your training. But, of course we still care about you, Buck. So, Buck, we're just glad you're safe. Hey everyone, I'm sure happy. You all did this just for me. But, uh, here I go and cause you all trouble again. I can't seem to do anything right. Yo, yo. What? That's not true. Nobody could take on an entire band of thieves by themselves, hey, hey. I could. You've gotten much stronger! You're worried about failing, but that's how everyone becomes stronger. That's how the best explorers get to be that way. So failure is nothing to be embarrassed about. Fieldmaster, everyone. Thank you. Thank you so much, truly. I'm sorry for troubling you. From now on, I won't be afraid of failure. I'll be patient. And do my best. Yeah. <laughs> that band of thieves were pretty second rate, weren't they? <laughs> hey, that's right. But never mind that. So this is Star Cave. They shouldn't have just given up and gone home. Hey, hey. Huh? But there's nothing here, right? Okay, this comes to a dead end right here. Jirachi's not here, right? Hey, Buck. Did you forget? We're an exploration team. Don't make fun of the Guildmaster's Guild. Collapse. There's a huge opening there. There's more to this cave? Alright! Let's go! I bet the, the rare Pokemon Jirachi is there. We should all think about what we're gonna ask for. Hey, hey! Oh my gosh, I'm so excited! Everyone, wait a moment. It's too bad, but not everyone can go ahead. What? Why not, Guildmaster? This exploration. This is Buck's exploration. What? Mine? By golly. Yep, Buck's. You're the one who got this map, Buck. And you're the one who's adventured all the way here. That's why you should go ahead alone, Buck. Yeah, when you say it like that, that's the way it should be. We can only help you this far. The rest is up to you, Buck. Use your own strength, and do your best to have a successful exploration. Guildmaster, thank you so much, yup yup. Buck, do your best. Be sure to tell us all about your exploration later. Do your best. <laughs> Everyone, thank you all so much. Okay then, I'm off, yup yup. I'll do my best exploring, yup yup. Hey! Do your best. I really want to go. You can do it, Buck. Do your best. There he goes. Hey, hey. Anyway, Guildmaster, you are cool today, as always. Yay! You think so? Yeah! Handing over to Exploration to Buck was a very generous gesture, I think. Because Jirachi will grant wishes, you know? So, you could have made a wish for all the perfect apples you can eat. <laughs> oh. Of course the Guildmaster is just wonderful. This, her personality and presence. She has such a commanding aura. 
We're all proud to say that we're apprentices in the guild. Hey, hey! I also joined the guild because I admired you, Guildmaster. Everyone, our wonderful Guildmaster's best pupil is me, and don't you forget it. Alright, I'm going. Hey! Everyone, stop the Guildmaster! Guildmaster, you can't do that! Oh my gosh, the Guildmaster is starting to struggle? Whoa, she's so strong! Ow, ow, ow! Everyone, we have to stop her no matter what! Anyway, the Guildmaster, she's so cool and mischievous. Yay! Star Cave Depths. Lunatone is a rock and psychic type. Slightly on the dangerous side, uh, but mostly because it resists normal type. <clears throat> By the way, when you use up a Reviver Seed, it turns into a Plain Seed. Plain Seeds do nothing, so feel free to just eat them. Of course, uh, later on in the story, we might have something to do with them, but Buck does not, and uh, we are kind of running out of space. Chili is not following us, so... We are free to explore to our heart's content. Let's go. It's, uh, it's like an interesting sort of layout. Oh no, it's Psyduck. Psyduck! <laughs> yeah, uh, more Orin Berries. Always glad to have more of those. We're gonna need at least one more totter seed, then, though. Preferably two. God oh, dang it. Don't res my defense, bro. That doesn't even make any sense. Don't make me run out of tackle PP either. I mean, seriously. Defense curl. Yeah, that's better. I guess it's south from that other room, or maybe it's south from that junction up there. It's south from that junction up there. Curses, I say. Bonk. I bonk you, and you are bonked. Nyahaha. I really should have gotten some water. <laughs> oh well. Too many apples. Alright, that's the thing. Confusion. And I am confused myself. Let's see. Yeah, if you throw an item while confused, it will still hit your enemy. It's a very nice fact to be aware of. But, uh, this is a little problematic. And now there's another one. There are no person berries in this game, just person bands. Person bands prevent you from getting confused. It's pretty nice. Ow. You, sir, are pain. You are pain. I say, you are pain. And now you are really pain. It is all over your face. Oh, hey, speak of the devil. <laughs> Maybe I'll equip that until we reach Dorachi. Ooh, then again, Psyduck. Good. Maybe that's a bad move. Well, it's not like I can't change out my equipment anytime I feel like it. It's a slightly pain. Oh boy, another one. Okay, I'm just about out of tackle with uh, PP. Uh, 
Yeah, I'm gonna use a max elixir. Ingest! We swallow our medicine. This game, uh... I feel like the translators were not quite perfect. <laughs> oh well. A rainy orb, uh, we are probably not going to use one of it. Yep, let's heal. Doinky doinky donk. That's what I say. Don't know why I say that, but it's a thing that I say. Yay! Level up! Oh shucks, I leveled up. Gosh, Sora, I think there might be a lucky emblem here. Cave pit? Oh, I guess it was only a three part dungeon. I've come pretty far. Golly, this here looks like another dead end. Yup, yup. Is this here really, really the deepest point in the cave? Yeah, so sleepy. <sighs> Where is that voice? Wait a minute. Is that voice. Who is it? Who's there? <sighs> you mean me? I'm Buck. Who are you? Me? Jirachi. <sighs> Jirachi! <sighs> 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 Jirachi, aren't you? Mm, that's right. Speaking of, who are you? I'm Buck. Didn't I already say that? Uh, um. Wait. I heard that you uh, that you can grant wishes, Jirachi. Is it really true? Yep, it's true. I know, Chris. Sleepy. I can't really help you. Sorry. And I usually toss and turn my sleep. So if you go by, I'll probably attack you. Sorry if I do. What? <sighs> so sleepy. He's got me doing it. <laughs> So yeah, if you want a totter seed, the f if you have a totter seed, rather, the first thing to do is confuse Jirachi. Also, equip a zinc band if you are able. Jirachi is a psychic and steel type, so your moves will not be very effective. But, Graveler Rocks always do 20 damage. So stock up, if you can. Let's curl our defense. Of course, uh, Jirachi's uh, most dangerous moves are, spe are his special attacks. I don't know if he's a boy or girl, really. Eh, I only have one Reviver Seed, though. That's problematic. Well, we've got maxed out defense, so, um... Ooh, jeez. Now we run away. Eh, yep, that was bound to happen at some point. We're just gonna have to power through. Rest? Okay. 
<laughs> that was almost very bad. What? What? what what's going on? What? <sighs> All right, I'm fully awake. So, so awake. <sighs> My name is Jirachi. Um, who are you? I'm Buck. Golly, how many times do I need to tell him? Your name is Buck. So, Buck, you better listen well. I grant wishes for those who manage to wake me up. What? All of a sudden? Oh, I'm not ready for this yet. Ahem. <sighs> All right, I'll listen. What is your wish, Buck? My wish? My wish is... Um... Save state time! These are all pretty funny. To become rich. That's a really nice wish and all, but... My dream... Be a strongest Pokemon. That's a really nice wish and all. To rule the world! To rule the world. That's a really nice wish and all. <laughs> Alright, is that all he's gonna say? Alright then. That's right. My dream, it was to become the best explorer ever. Yup, yup. Huh? Something wrong? What's your wish, Buck? Something wrong? You don't have a wish? My dream is to become the best explorer ever. Yup, yup. The best explorer. Got it. That's pretty easy. Okay, here we go. Uh, wait, 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 wait a moment, please. Huh? What is it? Golly, well, my dream is to become the best explorer ever. That's true. At first, I thought I'd come down here and ask you for that. Yep, yep. But I'm giving up on that plan. Truly. Why? Because because I've come to see it's not something you can wish for, by golly. you got to work hard. Once you've really done your best, put in the effort, then you can feel like a worthy explorer. you got to have lots of experiences, lots of feelings and memories. Those are ways you learn, grow, and get better, little by little. Yup, yup. Yes siree, I got a lot clearer on all this stuff during this adventure. So my wish to be the best explorer ever? And Jirachi, I'm not asking you for that anymore. Yeah, I see. Well spoken. So you don't have any wishes? What you just said, it shows something about you. Not everyone can resist being greedy. You're a good Pokemon, Buck. I've come to like you. So if you don't have a wish right now... Uh, oh, wait just a moment, please. Yup, yup. What is it? You just said a nice thing about me not being greedy, Jirachi, so maybe I shouldn't ask. It's alright. Go ahead. If... if you'll still grant me a wish, I wish... I wish for a buddy I could teach stuff to. A buddy? You're training at the guild, aren't you, Buck? So, you want a buddy, Buck? Someone you can show around and give a helping hand to? That's right. During this adventure, I... Golly, thanks to the Guildmaster and everyone in the guild caring about me, I feel so incredibly happy. Yup. But, I don't want to get used to it and start acting spoiled or anything. That's why... That's the reason I'd like a pal or two. If I had a buddy, a pal I could share what I learned with, I... Better and better as I push forward, you know what I mean? Yes, got it. Your wish, Buck, I will make it come true. Really? Yep. Maybe it won't be soon, but sooner or later you'll see some new faces at the guild. You should look forward to it. Thank you, Jirachi. Thank you so much. <laughs> and so? And so my exploration of Star Cave came to an end. Yep, yep. And now... Huh? Daniel. Your eyes look a bit puffy, Daniel. What's wrong? Couldn't sleep? Huh? My eyes too? I see. We're pretty busy every day with assignments, aren't we? 
We just entered a guild and there's so much, still so much we don't know, but let's keep at it. Really? There really is a new apprentice. Not only that, there are two of them. Jirachi, thank you so much. Yup, yup. As your older buddy, Daniel and Abram, I won't let you down. I'm going to work hard at my guild training each and every day. And so, Buck fulfilled his dream of becoming a senpai. Now, if only the game would notice him. <laughs> so, yeah, that uh, that special episode uh, took a little longer than I would have wanted, but, I mean, what you really gonna do about that, you know? <laughs> <coughs> this is a nice uh, ending scene. So, special episode one has come to an end. Pokey and items obtained in the special episodes will be stored in the bank and storage, respectively. Cool. Now I can save. And thank you all for watching. Next time, we will get back to these tale of Daniel and Abram. See you all then.